The Bachelor of Health Sciences program is this concept of a pathway to a health profession. And we have now built this program, purpose-built, with a competency framework. And why did we do that? Because a competency framework is, a, is the framework for health professions. It is the standard for health professions. It's going to prepare students really well for any health program that they want to go into. And I particularly love the way it's been built right from the ground using the CanMeds competencies. So every single part of every course can be linked back to that in some way. So what has happened in the health professions is a recognition that it's not just about having a bunch of thoughts in your head and memorizing them and giving them back on a multiple choice exam. It's actually being able to do something with the logic. It may be something like, I need to learn how to advocate for a particular idea to another group and get them to buy into this new program, this new policy. That's advocacy. But then I may maybe have to do that as a team member. I can't do it alone. I'm not so skilled that I can do everything myself. So they have to be a collaborator. Then we want them to say something like, you know what, I want to be a scholar. I want to critically think. I want to think up an idea, ask a question, generate a hypothesis, and come up with a really new concept myself. And that's what a scholar competence is. So competencies like that are the application of knowledge, the true application at a university with advanced knowledge. So we're very excited because it brings us into the realm of the health professions in the here and now. For my part, uh, I'm an advocate and I see myself that way and in the School of Medicine I'm the advocacy lead so that's the competency that I'm the most interested in but I really see how it's going to be built into every course and be able to be evaluated. So students who take this program are going to be exposed to a competency framework as an undergrad student and that will be for the first time in, in anywhere. 